So people, we have something amazing today. The reveal of the DLC 4's trailer. Now I won't hold you back in watching this thing. Hit that like button and let's check this thing out. People, this is DLC 4, Psycho Krieg and Fantastic Foster Clock. What goes through the mind of a psycho? We are about to find out. Say hello to a torturing nightmare! It's just following an angry anthropomorphic brain train into a strange portal. What's the worst that could happen? Open bestiality! It's sesame, you meathead. The meat maestro. <laughs> Hope you're up for some weird stuff, Vault Hunter. <laughs> Now how's it going guys, my name's DPJ and today I bring you another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like, it really helps out. And subscribe if you do want to see more. So how amazing was that trailer people? Doesn't it look just great? Now I have a few more details on this DLC and what it's all going to be about. So let's check those out. So the DLC drops September 10th, which is literally right around the corner. Not far away at all. And what else will this DLC offer? What will we venture into? Well a small description we have is, Psycho Krieg and the fantastic Foster Clock dares to ask, what makes the bloodthirsty psychos of Borderlands so uniformly deranged? Brilliant scientist Patricia Tannis believes they've been driven insane by the knowledge of a mythical place she calls Vortala, and the key to uncovering this legendary location lies within the mind of Krieg the most badass cycle of them all. So naturally, Tannis is sending you on a mission into Krieg's chaotic mind in search of clues. Only by surviving the perils of Krieg's twisted inner world can you reap the rewards of Voltala. How both sides of Krieg's dual psych process his traumatic memories by blasting his inner demons to bits and try not to succumb to lunacy inside Krieg's fractured mindscapes as you journey through the many demented vistas of Krieg's psych, where anything is possible and likely very violent. Experience the world as Krieg sees it, including his perception of fan favourite characters like Maya, the light of his twisted life. Overcome a vast array of life threatening manifestations that Krieg's mind conjures up. Expand Krieg's mind and Tennis's research in surreal side missions and crew challenges. Score powerful legendary weapons and gear that will still work outside of Krieg's consciousness, according to Tannis. Acquire brain busting cosmetic items, including Vault Hunter heads and skins. But people, the details on what comes this DLC doesn't end there. We also get a new level cap increase. We're going up to 65. Five more extra levels are being added on September 10th with this DLC. And Gearbox do state this will be the final increase for the foreseeable future. So I actually think we have some amazing times ahead. Now this DLC and what it stands for is really something I predicted a while back and knew we wouldn't get Krieg back as a playable character, although that would be amazing. I just knew it wouldn't happen, I said in the past. I actually feel this DLC will be on the basis of us playing out his memories. Now although this isn't an exact description of what we see, it is along the lines as we go deep within Krieg's mind and experience what life as a psycho is all about. Now I know we saw Maya in the trailer, but yeah, she isn't back I don't believe. She is a part of Krieg's mind and we will meet Maya again, but Krieg's perception of her which will be pretty epic. I also don't think she will be the only character we come across within the mind of Krieg, which will be interesting as these characters will be portrayed as Krieg himself sees them, which could be hilarious and terrifying at the same time. Also I wonder who the main story boss will be, will it be Krieg himself or the giant version we see within this trailer? Kinda makes sense if you ask me, but yeah, 
This is a DLC I'm super looking forward to. Krieg was by far my favourite character up until Zane, so it's going to be an amazing DLC, an amazing addition to have him back and to actually see where this next venture leads. And in general learning more about him. So what do you think about this DLC? What do you think about the trailer and what do you think this DLC will behold? Let me know down below within that comment section. Are you hyped like I am? Because I am super looking forward to this. Krieg, like I said, it was my favourite character before Zayn. I know he's a fan favourite across the board. A lot of people in the Borderlands community absolutely love this dude and are super hyped about him coming back. So let me know your thoughts down below within that comment section. But on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. This has been the review of trailer of DLC 4 for Borderlands 3. Psycho Krieg and the fantastic Foster Cluck. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave it a like, it really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more BR3, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video or upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.